all you kids out there and welcome to my next session. I'm going to show you how to solve fractional algebraic equations. This is our problem. It's hard to solve it without getting rid of the denominators, so I'll scale it by its LCM, or lowest common multiple, and then the de denominators disappear. So the LCM equals the product of the two denominators. X plus 1 times x minus 1. Now, I multiply the whole equation by the LCM. x plus 1 times x minus 1 times minus x plus 7 over x plus 1 minus x plus 1 times x minus 1 times 3x minus 1 divided by or over x minus 1 and then equals minus 3 times minus 3 times x plus 1 times x minus 1 now I can cancel out some of the values. So I can see that x plus 1 and x plus 1 cancel out. So you're left with minus sorry and you can cancel out minus x minus 1 and x minus 1, so you're left with x plus 1 times 3x minus 1 equals minus 3 times x plus 1 times x minus 1. Now, I'll expand you the, using the lattice method. So, Draw it up like this. Put the multiplication sign there. Now fill in the gaps. X minus 1. X minus 1. Minus X and 7. 7. Now multiply. Minus X times X is minus X squared. Minus X times minus 1 is X. 7 times x is 7x, 7 times minus 1 is minus 7. Now to get the full answer, add the diagonals. X minus x squared, 7x plus x is 8x, and minus 7. Minus, right, square bracket, now we'll do that bracket using the lattice method x plus 1 so x and 1 and 3x minus 1 3x minus 1 ok 3x times x is 3x squared 3x times 1 is 3x Minus 1 times x is minus x. Minus 1 times, min times 1 is minus 1. Now add the diagonals. 3x squared. And 3x minus x is 2x. And 1. Then close the bracket. Equals. Minus 3 times 
Um, I'll do the lettuce method again. X plus 1 up the top. X minus 1 down the bottom. Now multiply x squared. X minus x minus 1. Now add the diagonals. X squared. That 0, so we don't bother writing it. Minus 1. Now, I'll expand this bracket and solve. Minus 2x plus 1 equals, now expand that bracket, minus 3x squared plus 3. Now I'll collect all the terms. Um, minus 3x squared minus x minus 4x squared and 8x minus 2x plus 6x. Minus 7 plus 1 minus 6 equals minus 3x squared plus 3. Now, collect these terms to the side. So it becomes 4x squared. And you move this term to the left, it becomes plus 3x squared plus 6x. When you move that to the left, it becomes a negative. Minus 6 minus 3 equals 0. And do the, uh, do this, just tidy up. Minus x squared plus 6x minus 9 equals 0. Now multiply it by negative 1 for the quadratic, which is x squared minus 6x plus 9 equals 0. Now, I can see that's a quadratic, so I'll just write the formula, the normal equation for a quadratic. a x squared plus b x plus c equals 0 minus b plus or minus square root b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Now I, I can identify my a, my b and my c. So a equals 1, c equals minus 6, wait no, b equals minus 6, c equals 9. And now let's do the substitution. Minus 6 times minus 1 is 6, plus or minus, square root. The square root of negative, um, if you square negative 6, it's the 6. Minus 4 times a, which is minus 4, times 9 is minus 36, over 2 times a, which is 2, x equals equals 6 plus or minus 0 over 2 equals 6 over 2 equals 3.